published 0922 EDT, 13 October 2017 Updated 1049 EDT, 13 October 2017 Arsenal geared up for their first match back after the international break with a full-blooded training session as Alexis Sanchez put the disappointment of missing out on World Cup qualification behind him alongside his club teammates. Sanchez was joined by key players Mesut Ozil, Alexander Lacazette and Laurent Koscielny as Arsenal squad were put through their paces at London Colney on Friday. The Gunners are gearing up to face Watford at Vicarage Road on Saturday evening looking to pick up where they left off following a run of three wins in their last four Premier League matches. Alexis Sanchez looked upbeat as the Chilean returned to club action with a training session Mesut Ozil trained after missing out on Germany's squad for their World Cup qualifying games Jack Wilshere is pushing for his first Premier League appearance of the season on Saturday Jack Wilshere was also among the stars in the thick of the action as the midfielder searches for this first league appearance of the season after featuring in the EFL Cup and Europa League. One notable absentee was centre-back Skadran Mustafi, who suffered an injury while playing for Germany against Albania over the international break. However despite concerns over their fitness heading into the Watford clash, most of his fellow defenders Kashilny and Seed Kalasinak both featured in training. Arsene Wenger revealed that Sanchez was in a difficult place after his country Chile failed to qualify for the 2018 World Cup but encouraged him to turn his attentions back to club football with Arsenal. Ozil is challenged by Granite Soccer right during the session at London Colney on Friday Olivier Giroud is pursued by Per Mertzacker as the pair compete during Arsenal training striker Danny Welbeck shared a joke with the cameraman by placing his finger to his lips Chile, lost 30 to Brazil in their final South American qualifying clash meaning the Copa America holders will not be at Russia next summer. Wenger is considering selling Sanchez in the January transfer window to avoid losing him for nothing at the end of the season when his contract expires. When asked if there was a chance Sanchez could leave in January, Wenger admitted it is possible. Once you are in our kind of situation, we have envisaged every solution, yes. However Wenger had a more positive update on the future of Ozil with the German's contract also said to run out next summer, saying that he was hopeful the midfielder would remain at the club beyond the season. Arsene Wenger watches on as Wilshere trains ahead of Saturday's trip to Vicarage Road Wenger admitted there was a chance Sanchez could be sold in the January transfer window Laurent Koscielny shrugged off concerns over his fitness as he joined in the training session Also made a brief cameo as our late substitute in Arsenal's win over West Brom but did not feature in the Gunners' last match before the international break, the 20 win over Brighton due to a knee problem. The 28-year-old was not included in Germany's squad over the international break as he recovered from the injury, but is available for the Watford game. Wenger suggested Wilshere would continue to be involved in Arsenal matches this season, and insisted that if fully fit, the midfielder will secure a place in England's squad for the World Cup in Russia. I don't think he has to leave to gain his spot in England's World Cup squad, Wenger said. I believe Jack is in the best form I've seen for a long time. He is very close to being considered like anyone else. Hector Bellerin spent the majority of the 201,314 season on loan at Watford from Arsenal Alexander Lacazette has made a fast start to life at Arsenal after joining from Lyon this summer Nacho Monreal has featured as a left-sided centre-back in a three-man defence this season Adrill I believe he doesn't necessarily have to leave Arsenal to reach the World Cup. If keeps going like he is going at the moment, he will go to the World Cup, I am sure. I don't see Jack being fully fit and not going to the World Cup. He has played games for us this season and he will play many more. Arsenal have bounced back from their 40 thrashing at the hands of Liverpool in late August to secure three wins and one draw from their last four league games. Wenger's men have tightened up at the back also, with four consecutive clean sheets since being torn apart at Anfield. Alex Iwobi scored for Arsenal last time out in the 20 win over Brighton at the Emirates Petrosec has kept four consecutive clean sheets in the Premier League with Arsenal Sanchez, 
was left crestfallen as Chile were beaten 30 by Brazil to end their World Cup hopes.